I hope that 2023 is your best year yet. Now that won't happen accidentally. It won't just happen that 2023 will be your greatest year. You'll have to do some things. There are some commitments you can make, some principles that you can apply to your life. And if you'll do those things, you can set yourself up for success and make it possible for 2023 to be one of the greatest years you've ever experienced. And one of the things you should be committed to is your relationships, and I know you are. But let's talk about what happens in your relationships when somebody offends you, when somebody fails you, when somebody hurts you, when somebody lets you down, when somebody you love doesn't do something you think they should have done or does something you think they should not have done. Is there something that you, as a Jesus follower, can do during these times in life that are inevitable? Is there something you can do to make sure that your relationships are on good footing, uh, are, are set up to grow, are in a good place to heal, and are in a good place to offer forgiveness and grace? I think there is, and it's a little phrase that we can catch and learn from 1 Corinthians chapter 13, which is probably known by most of you as the love chapter. One of the things that love does is it believes the best. Some translations say always trusts. I like the phrase believes the best. So one of the things that you can do to make sure 2023 is a great year in your relationships is just be committed to believing the best about the people that you love. Believe the best about the people you love because you're not always going to see the best out of or in the people that you love. The people you love will let you down. The people you love will hurt you. The people you love will offend you. And then you have a choice when that happens. You can assume the worst about those people or you can choose to believe the best. And I can tell you from experience that assuming the worst about a person whenever there's a crisis or an offense or a hurt, assuming the worst makes it worse. It just does. It just makes the whole situation worse. But believing the best sets you up for healing and forgiveness and grace and moving forward. Believing the best is something that love does. If you truly love somebody, when they hurt you, when they offend you, you find the most generous answer that you possibly can for their, for their behavior. That's believing the best. They let me down, but I bet there was something going on in their life bigger than the thing I was expecting. They hurt me, but I bet they weren't intending to hurt me. I bet they didn't intentionally hurt me. She offended me but I'm going to believe that she didn't mean to offend me and if she knew that I was offended, she would make it right. Believing the best is something that will set you up for a great year. Now, I know what you're thinking because when I hear believe the best about people, I know it's really hard. It is hard to do. It is difficult to, when you're hurt, when you're offended, when you're let down, to believe the best about the person who hurt you or offended you or let you down. But there's a little secret that you can apply that really helps me. I know when I hurt somebody, what I want them to do for me is just believe the best about me. When I offend somebody, what I want them to do for me is to believe the best about me. When I let somebody down, what I really hope they do is believe the best about me, not assume the worst. And so this is something I really hope people will do, the people that I love. I hope when I fail them, they will believe the best about me. And if that's what I want from my friends and my family, then that's something I also have to offer. So if it's something I want, it's something I should also offer to the people I love. Believing the best. Love always trusts. Love believes the best. It's a small little phrase, but it has huge implications and it can have a huge impact on your life in 2023. If you will be committed today and tomorrow, in the rest of the year. When I'm hurt by people I love, when I'm offended by people I love, I'm going to choose to believe the best. That will set you up for a great 2023. So believe the best. See you.